What's up, suckers? It has been a long time since I really streamed. Uh, but tonight, we are going to multibox. You are finally going to multibox. You've been putting it off and putting it off and saying, It's too hard. It's not too hard. I am going to show you how it's done. I'm going to show you every step. And we are going to try my stuff in real time. Man, I hope it works. Uh, do you like raiding and leveling up to 60 on Classic WoW and then jumping in your molten core raid and finally seeing that one drop that you've been wanting for months and a hunter rolls on it and wins well when you multi box that never happens you win every roll and today I'm going to show you how to take a break from classic WoW come back to one of these private servers and play WoW in a completely different way. So let's just jump in. The server I recommend is the only server you're going to find on the internet that is dedicated to the prospect of multiboxing. It's called Multibox WoW. Go to www.multiboxwow.com. It is my server and it there are a lot of special things about it that are multi box specific and maybe I'll mention them as we as the night goes on but but really what I want to do is drink a whole lot of beer and try and talk you through and talk myself through actually multi boxing um, real characters and we're gonna start by going through the entire process of registering tunes and um, then I'll show you where to go to, to download a multibox system that will work for you. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to multiboxwow.com and register and we're going to pick a username say um, Big Donkey. Big Donkey. And email is going to be Big Donkey at donkey.com. I, I don't send out any emails to you, so I don't really care what email you use. I'm, I'm not even sure we can do anything with the email address. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. Okay, so the password is going to be uh, four letters. You'll find out what those letters are later. And we're going to create, actually, you know what, just for the sake of going fast I'm only gonna create five accounts notice I can create a bunch of accounts all at once and notice what the account names are gonna be we printed it in red okay people have trouble with this every time see my username my username is big donkey how many accounts to create username one comma username two comma username three what do you think the accounts are gonna be named there's no big donkey account it is big donkey one Big Donkey 2, Big Donkey 3, etc. Unless you only create one account, then I won't put a number on the end. But we're going to create. Uh, do I want to do 10? I don't think I want to do. I don't think I want to do 10. Uh, we're going to keep it to 5. All right. You, I'll let you explore the mystery of 10, 20, and 40 accounts. But we're just going to do 5 right now. And. I'm going to click five. I'm going to say I'm not a robot. I'm a register. Successfully registered. Well, that was easy. I now have five accounts on multiboxwow.com. Okay, so now what do I do, Uncle Fury Swipes? Well, if, now what you do is you go to five minute multi barksing, not barksing boxing.com and you check it out this is also my website this website is a little different this website is dedicated to explain to people how to multibox with my crappy system 5-minute multiboxing.com which I maintain off and on throughout the year and throughout the years um, 
So I'm going to show you how to use this website. First of first off, when you get to this website, you're on the page you need to be. All right. Notice I say, "Come play on my server, multiboxwow.com." You should do that. Um, I give you all the instructions you need. All right, step by step instructions. And you know what? We're going to go over them tonight because I'm going to follow them. I'm going to eat my own cooking, as it were. I hope the sausage is good. Before you start, get rid of the NVIDIA experience, also called the GeForce experience. Also, any Razer drivers that interfere with F10. Razer drivers are little um, trendy mouse drivers that uh, interfere with uh, the, the keyboard buttons. First, if you don't have WoW, download the full package from the downloads page. The downloads page is right here on 5minutemoldyboxing.com. Just go over to downloads, look at full package. You can download the full package, all right? It's big. It's 5 gig. It'll download a vanilla WoW install for you. If you already have a vanilla WoW install, um, don't download that. All right? Don't download that. That's just going to waste time. So let's go back to, back to the guide. I'm going to keep flipping back and forth. Uh, ooh, you can't even see this shit, huh? Um, let's make it bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay. Oh, you can see that now. Don't tell me you can't see that. You can see it. Uh, before you start, get rid of the NVIDIA experience. Very important. You will not multibox with the NVIDIA experience installed. Don't skip it. Ooh, I get angry about that. Because every time somebody comes onto the Discord, says, Hey, my R4 doesn't work. How come it doesn't work? You didn't get rid of the NVIDIA experience, did you? doesn't interfere with anything. Shut up. Scrub. Go back to Lights Hope Chapel or whatever that server is. All right. First, if you don't have WoW, download it. Okay. I'm going to pretend I already did that because we ain't going to wait for that to happen. I created a very fresh version of WoW right here. You, you're going to have a kind of a hard time seeing my Windows files and crap like that. So don't don't whine about that. All right, people. Um, download and unzip the latest add-on package from the downloads page into your WoW.exe directory. Now I'm going to watch you. I'm going to watch you. I'm going to watch you do this. You do this right now. I'm watching. <laughs> no, I'm not going to watch you do this. I'm actually going to do this. Okay, so we're going to go to the downloads page. All right, downloads, and we're going to download the add-ons package. Click. Okay, this takes you to my. Google Drive. So go up here to the upper right and just click download. And it'll download into what is this crap? Choose an account to use with Google Drive. I guess I'll use Furious Wipes. It's not letting me. I don't care. Just any account, damn it. Is it working? I think it's working. Yeah, it's working. Okay. When that's finished unzipping, open it, and now you notice you've got an add-ons directory. What I like to do in Windows 7, where's, where's my camera? Hello. I just like to go in here, do a control A, control C, and then I just go into my WoW directory. Where'd I put it? So here's my WoW directory, and I just do a control V. Bam! And it copied everything. And it's saying, hey, you already have a WTF directory. Do you want to copy this? Yes. Do you want to copy and replace this? Oh, yes. Okay. We're there. We made it. We are wowing. Now, what I want you to do is continue following the directions. Because let's go back to the directions. Boink. Okay. Okay. Going back to the directions. Don't mind me slapping my mouse around. Slap your mouse up. Okay, so we did this part. We downloaded and unzipped the latest add-on package into my wow.exe directory. Update with the latest. Okay, so what do I mean by update with the latest? That means 
join my Discord. Let me bring my Discord up. Is it over here? I think it's over here. Discord, are you there? Yep. All right, so come join the five-minute multiboxing Discord. All right? And once you're in there, can you see this? I think you can see this. Once you're in there, I want you to go to the download 5MMB channel. Scroll all the way down and look at the latest crap. All right, the two files I really want you to copy over is the latest 5-minute multiboxing.tickle and the latest smextend.lua. That one, don't do that one right now. But that one, when I, when I release a later one, I don't have a later one right now. Actually, you notice add-ons 061719.zip, that's the latest. You don't even have to do the copy later. You only have to copy 5, 5mmb.tickle or smxtend.lua if they are a later version than this one. That is, if they're below this one, if I've updated it. But today, you're in luck. You don't actually have to update anything. So we aren't going to update anything. Everything's up to date. Okay. Notice I, I wrote all the stuff you have to copy and where you got to copy it right there. So don't whine and tell me I don't know where to give it. Uh, then set your realmless WTF to uh, log on to multiboxwire.com. That'll put you on my server. Let's look and see if my realm list is right. Mm, looks good. I had already changed that before the video. At this point, you should have your accounts. We do. Uh, big donkey, right? Go to multiboxwild.com and register like 40. Note, big note. Create your 40 accounts with a single name. No numbers at the end say Fookers. Your accounts will be Fookers 1, Fookers 2, Fookers 3. You will not have an account named just Fookers. I can't stress that enough because that will be the first thing you ask on my Discord server. Hey, my accounts didn't work because you tried Fookers. There's no Fookers. So... What can I do, man? You don't read? You don't want to follow my directions in, in red? I, I can't hold your hand any more than that, bro. Now, we're going to go edit tunelist.txt. I've made this really simple for you, okay, people? But I want you to edit tunelist.txt with something that's not Notepad. All right? This is another thing that trips people up. Notepad is terrible. It runs lines together. You can't even tell that you've run lines together. Get Notepad++, trust me, before you do this. So we're going to go edit tunelist.txt. Hopefully none of my passwords are here. I'm going to make this bigger. Uh, this is the sample tunelist.txt, by the way. Select font. Let's go to 25. There we go. You can see that, right? So these are the sample accounts and passwords that um, that ship with the sample file. All right, we're going to go. We're going to go. Donkey account one is going to be donkey. Wait, isn't it big donkey? Big donkey one. I haven't told you what my password is yet, so you can't snipe my stream and log in these guys at the same time. Please don't do that. It's going to make the Stream so bad. Big donkey two. Bam! And I'm using VI or Vim, uh, which is a, a editor that's used in the technical world. Um, I don't recommend it, um, but if you know how to use VI or Vim, you should use that editor for sure. Uh, okay, so let's name our guys. Before I throw the password out there, I'm going to name our guys. <sighs> okay, so make some names that you know are going to be available, like um, Roy. <laughs> Roy. Roy might not be available. I can't stress enough that you should not use Roy. Um, we're going to... Uh, um, I Warrior is going to be my tank. Notice... I've got I've already got a role in here. I'm gonna keep it at tank. I priest. Uh that's gonna be a healer. Put a roll. 
Um, I rogue. It's gonna be a melee. Um, I mage. Gonna be a caster. And what else do we need? Uh, maybe one more caster. I don't know. Uh, we'll do a hunter. Okay. Oh my gosh. That says image, not I mage. I hunter. Hunter. Raid name Todd's raid. Uh, I'll change that. You don't know my name's Todd. Don't dox me, bro. Uh, Fury raid. F not furry. Fury raid. Damn it. Uh, who do you want all the gold to go to when you um, pass gold around? I'm going to make it I Warrior. And who do you want all the BOEs to go to that you pick up when you auto trade BOEs? I'm going to make it I Priest. No, I'm going to make it I Mage. I Mage. <laughs> Image! I Mage. Okay, there you go. Um, there's a couple of other lines here you don't really need to know much about. I'm going to change monitor 1K to monitor 4K because I have a 4K monitor, not a 1K monitor. My keyboard is US. You might change yours to UK or DE for Deutschland or Germany. Um, or other. Other also works. All right, your, your, your keyboard might be other. So if you find things not working, you might want to try other. I'm going to right quit. Okay, tune list is done. Now, once your tune list is finished, Editing, I want you to run 5mmb.bat. Double click it. Run, beach. Are you sure you want to overwrite this file? Yes. Sometimes, after you run it the first time, it'll ask you, are you sure you want to overwrite two files? Because there will be two files there to overwrite um, after the first time you run it. So, um, there you go. Now I want you to start this file, hotkeynet.exe. Um, do you want brr, brr, allow HockeyNet to communicate to yes allow access you can tell this is so fresh it's really asking for everything so you're gonna say load script and there's a script that got created when you ran that bat file so I'm gonna go to the script I'm in right here and the script is called uh, 5mmbhkn.txt and you're going to tell it to load that. Check for errors. Now you might have errors. You will definitely have errors if you have no hunter specified. Um, you will have errors if you have no melee specified. Those errors are, are don't care. Don't worry about those errors. You don't know. What do you know? Don't even look for errors. Um, so now we're good. We're good to go. We can actually start multiboxing. We're going to hit the scroll lock key so that scroll lock is on. And if you remember in our um, tune list.txt, there was a little letter at the end of all our box lines. That letter is what raid we're in. Our raid is, our default raid is M. So we're going to hit Control Alt M and see what happens. I'm nervous. This. Is this going to work? Oh, oh, oh. Wow. It opened my five windows and it filled in the windows with big donkey. One, two, three, four. But you know what? I forgot to actually get the password right. So I'm just going to, without you knowing it, I'm just going to type the password in each window. Now, what you should do is get the, um, get the password right in your tunelist.txt file. But so you don't snipe my stream, I am not going to tell you the password today. So, turn scroll lock back on. By the way, whenever you have to type, you gotta turn that scroll lock back off. Cause scroll lock intercepts all your keys for multiboxing and it won't let you type. Not right anyway. You'll s any letter I've assigned to multiboxing, it's just going to not send to the application you're typing in. So, turn scroll lock off whenever you need to type a password. Now I turn scroll lock back on, and now I'm going to tilde. T 
Hilda is that key right there next to one. It's a squiggly line on, on most keyboards, on all the American keyboards. It might not be a squiggly line on your keyboard, but it is the key next to one on your keyboard, to the left of one. Hold that key down and click. Look where my mouse is. Can you see my mouse? Click on the smaller windows. Click the login button on one of the smaller windows. Oh, look at that. They all logged in at the same time. All right. Now, hold tilde down. Click English. And click player versus player. Because my realm is player versus player. And then suggest realm. Now it's going to suggest the Azeroth realm. Everything is going well, I'm telling you. And you're going to click tilde click accept. Wow. Okay. So we're all logged in to WoW, but you know what? Um, we don't have any characters. We made names for characters, okay? And notice that all of your windows kind of have those names integrated in the window name. It tells you what character belongs to what window. You probably can't see that in the stream very well. So uh, don't worry if you can't quite see it. But they're there. I show you. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to create our characters from what we have here in tunelist.txt. Now, can you see my tunelist.txt? Probably not. I'm going to make it a little bigger. Um, let's make it 15. Whoa, scroll lock's on. See, it didn't let me type 15. Okay. Come on, man. Why you got to be like that? Size 15. I said, what, do I got to select it all? Hey, hey, what can I do? 15. Ugh. Why are you not changing, you biatch? I said, let's say courier 15. Okay, there we go. You can probably see that. No, that's still not big enough. Two, seven, two, eight. Bam! Big donkey. Okay, you can see my shit, but I am out of beer, so please wait. I'm streaming actually so if I'm not streaming I will post this afterward it'll be fine uh, you just didn't get to talk to me uh, all right so let's do scroll lock is off we're gonna create new character this is the I priest window and we are going to go can we go all of one type I think we can we're going to go all orcs and trolls. That way we all appear in the same vicinity. So we're going to do, this is I priest. Let's do troll priest. His name is I priest. And this is the first big test. Is the name you guessed you would get acceptable? Yes. Next one, I rogue. Make him a troll rogue. Yes, we can do troll rogue. I rogue. Yes, two for two. All right, I mage. I mage, otherwise known as image. 
I'm age. Let's see if we can do an I'm age. I'm age. Yes! All right, we're going to go over to I Hunter. Troll Hunter. Can you tell I like trolls? Uh, yeah, Troll Hunter. Boom. I Hunter. Bam. And now we're going to do the most important one. Troll, manly troll. Not troll, orc. Wait, trolls can be warriors, right? Could do warrior troll. I think I might do warrior troll. Why not just a gang of trolls? I warrior. Yoo -hoo 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 -hoo. All of them made it, baby. All right. So there we are. We have done all the steps up to multiboxing. And I'm just going to now put scroll lock on and tilde click our boys. Nothing happened. There, there it goes. It took them a while. Okay, so this is the first time we've ever logged in. And so they're all going to play a movie. Did you notice that? Um, don't worry about that auction frame thing. Did you notice that um, all the windows were sized as soon as we logged in? It didn't. It wasn't full screen. That's because that's part of the setup I give you when you copy the add-ons zip file in. So here's what we're gonna do. Um, we are going to first off find our mouse first we're gonna escape the escape key will send escape to all the windows then we're gonna tilde click this error message I don't know why the error message is there that shouldn't be there um, then we're gonna tilde click the display tips button sometimes the big window doesn't tilde click in the same way as the small window that's why you always want to tilde click the small window first that you get as many windows as possible clicking um, then you're going to click OK alright and now you're gonna do something really important this is the key to multiboxing you're going to initialize all your buttons control I now you'll notice I'm typing slash init when you do that, I'm typing slash in it into each of your windows. Actually, do it twice, just in case. You probably don't have to do it twice anymore, but traditionally, I've had to. All right, so now you need to make a party if you want to multibox. If you want people to follow each other around, you need to make a party. And you make a party in five minute multibox by hitting the zero key. Hit it a couple times, and now we're in a party right I hit it twice we're in a party are we multiboxing yet I don't know I'm gonna walk over here and I'm gonna say the magic key in five minute multiboxing is alt 4 alt 4 makes everybody focus on whoever you're controlling whichever window you're controlling makes everybody focus on that guy and follow that guy alt 4 once is focus Alt 4 again is follow. Oh man, they all followed. Shit works. Dude, it works. You're multiboxing. Now, I'm going to show you some of the new magic that's happening on 5-Minute Multiboxing.com. On MultiboxWow.com. Um, we have added a guy here in the start zone who will get you multiboxing quickly. Watch what happens when I talk to him. I'm going to actually go full screen here. Anytime you want, you can just go full screen by double clicking the bar. Okay, so we're full screen. I'm going to talk to this guy. Give me level 60. That's a smart thing to do. Woo! Look at all the stuff you just learned. Look at all the stuff. Look, you learned all your spells. You learned all your skills. You learned everything. 
You got everything, bruh. And now you're level 60. Uh, let's get some basic gear, bruh. Let's get some basic armor. Oh, look at this basic armor. It's super basic. It's super basic. It's green. All right. If you want something more than green, go earn it. Scrub. You ain't getting anything but green. All right. So we're going to go with... Woo, that's 25 stamina. I think I'm going to go with that one. 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 Now note, these actually now sell for nothing. Okay. You can't exploit these. Um, I'm going to go over here. You can't actually see this. But my backpack is full of gear, and I'm going to start putting it on. Boink, 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 boink. Let's see how I look. Um, I just sold all that gear back for zero. <laughs> all right, that's how not to do it. Pretend you didn't see that. I just sold it all back to the vendor because I didn't close the vendor. Okay, close the vendor, stupid. Equipping this item will bind it to you. Well, damn right it will. Give me, give me more. Give me more. Yeah, give me more. Oh, look at that. It's looking good. That is looking really good. Oh, my goodness. Not good bad guys i really have to see if i'm streaming i'm a little scared that i'm not streaming so i'm actually gonna go just check my stream real quick am i streaming yes ah see two people are watching i am streaming you suck us you suck us are watching all right so we got our armor we're gonna get some other general goods whoa woolen bag yeah let's get a couple of those Okay, I got some bags. I'm going to throw those in. What else are we going to get? Basic gear! Weapons! Uh, I am going to be a tank. So, I noticed that uh, there's no shield here. Um, I'll have a talk with my guy. We'll try and get a shield out there. Um, but for now, we're going to do a stamina at or agility axe that's a four stamina mace uh what's up player salt thank you for watching man um i'm gonna do the four stamina mace we're gonna we're gonna throw that in there and uh, there's no shield so first thing on the list is to go get a shield maybe maybe the shield's elsewhere because these are weapons after all so let's go for basic gear accessories. Seven stamina neck. Ooh, strength of Magumba. Uh, that is actually something you get out. That's kind of an exploit. So that's something you get out of uh, ZG. So good for you. You just got strength of Magumba. And let's see if he's got anything else for us. Basic gear apparel. What do you give me? What do you give me? Nothing. Basic gear apparel does nothing. Basic gear apparel. Nope, that does nothing. So, I'm going to be rolling with a one block shield right now. Not super great, but who cares, man? What do you want for nothing? This place is free. All right, let's do eye priest. Eye priest, get over here, man. Talk to the guy. Give me level 60. I have level 60. Um, I guess I don't have my book uh, buff spells, so that's going to be a problem, but that's all right. Give me some general goods. We're going to go with the woolen bags. Make sure you, whenever you try to equip something, I'm looking over here. You can't see this. I'm actually going to move my face up here. Uh, make sure you close the guy before you try to equip stuff. Otherwise, you'll just sell it back. Basic gear, weapons. What do we got? Wait. Uh, okay, fine. 
These are not very good weapons for priests. Guess I'm taking the hammer. I thought I would I thought I would get offered different weapons, so since I'm a priest, but ain't happening. Uh basic gear. Armor. See, I'm getting offered different armor when that I'm a priest, so why not a different weapon? I don't know. Uh we want spirit. We want spirit. We want hella spirit. Hella hella. Whoa. Um these are like the same. I guess it's just looks. Grabbing everything, grabbing a little bit of that, a little bit of this. Elunarian! Am I pronouncing that right? Hell yeah, I'm American. Whatever I pronounce, that's the way it's pronounced, brother. Elunarian. Actually, that's not true. If you're British, whatever way you pronounce it, that's the way it's pronounced. Elunarian. It is an Elunarian set. Hello. I'm from Elune. Wow, that's not bad. That is not bad. Let's zoom in on him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Camera going too fast. Wee woo, wee woo. Look at you, baby. Elunaria. <laughs> I don't think it's called Elunaria. Ooh, someone served me tequila. Thanks. That's cool, man. Oh, that's good. You know, I'm not trying to encourage drinking, but if you do throw a half squeezed lime into your shot of tequila, oh, it's so much better. It's so much better. I don't know if you guys drink tequila in Europe or not, but it's very, very big on the West Coast. And and whatever coast I'm on, it's it's big. It's huge. I don't care what coast I'm on, man. It's huge. All right. Let's roll my bro over. I rogue. Give me level 60. Level 60 is mine. Grabbing some wool bags. Equipping some wool bags. <laughs> yeah. These guys don't know what they're giving me. They don't know what they're giving me. Man, I keep clicking that thing again. Basic gear. Armor. Give me some leather armor. Yeah, Pride Lord shit. I'm 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 down with it. I'm down it's kind of, you know It's kind of uh it's kinda of druidish. Okay. But I'm gonna take it anyway. I'm a rogue, baby! I'm a rogue! Woo! 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 Oh, look at that. Look at me. Look at me. I don't have pants on. Did I not get pants? What's wrong with my pants? Really? Sexist game. Make me naked and like that just because I'm a woman. Look at that beauty. Man, she's as beautiful as my wife. I think I'm going to marry her. All right. Um, I make margaritas fairly often. Do like a shot sometimes with a beer. That's right, Player Salt. And are you on the West Coast? I bet you are. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> General Goods again. No, go back to basic gear. Let's get weapons. All right, the best dagger. Nine Jill. I do like daggers, but I like swords better. Um, I, I, I think I got to go with the Nine Jill daggers, though. A couple of those babies. Bam! And then drop this one over here. Bam! Whoa. Oh, fuck. I, I sold it back because I didn't close. Bam! Uh, basic gear. Uh, no, not apparel. Apparel doesn't work. Basic gear. Accessories. Give me my Rage of Magumba. Which one would you choose besides that? This is awesome. Rage of Magumba is awesome, man. All right, iRogue is done. 
We only got a couple guys left here. We're going to roll over to uh, I Mage. <laughs> Damn it! I Mage! I can't see it without laughing. We're going to roll over to Image. Grab my four woolen bags as my exploit. Gimme, 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 gimme. Gonna grab my basic gear. Uh, all right, we cl accidentally clicked on weapons first. Do we have a weapon with intellect? Nope. 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 Gonna have to talk talk with my guy. I'm gonna talk with my guy. Don't worry. I will talk with my guy. We'll throw some wands in there. We'll throw some intellect weapons. Get you started right. Uh, get out of that. Go back in. Basic gear. Now, how could... Oh, damn it. I click weapons again. How could Classic WoW be more fun than this? I ask you. Oh, we got Elunari and crap again. All right. Kind of repetitive, but whatever. Elunari and sick robes. I want some intellect, brother. Intellect, brother. What are you thinking, brah? You know what? It's okay. It gives you something to strive for. Go strive. Strive the hell out of this thing. Um. Boom. 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 Okay. Got my Elunarian on. Let me get my necklace. Oh, Pebble of Kajaro. Is that what it's called? I guess it's called Pebble of Kajaro. Taking it! Actually, I don't think I did that on the priest. Let's go check our priest. Uh, our priest did not take the accessories, so I'm going I'm to take that accessory. I have Zoldar! Ooh, that sounds better. Sounds hella better. All right, man, we are on the last thing. Eye Hunter. Eye Hunter is probably going to be the sketchiest of them all because I'm not going to have a pet. Classic better than 40 boxing. Schmitty? Schmitty, I know you don't mean that. I know you don't mean... Oh, okay. I think he's... I think I know what he means. I think he's like scoffing at the idea that classic would be better than 40 boxing. What are you doing here today? Uh, Smitty, what I'm doing here is showing you from beginning to end how to multi-box with my shit. And the new stuff that we have today on multiboxwow.com with a guy who gives you basic equipment. And here's my hunter taking basic equipment. Because my hunter's super basic. Equip. 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 Oh, I can already see where this is going. Equip. Because <laughs> I remember what weapons they were offering. I do not remember any missile weapons in the set. So, what the heck? Man, bra, man, bra. Okay, okay. So we're gonna go basic gear, accessories. I'll take my Maelstrom's tendril, and we're gonna go basic gear weapons. No, no, there is no, there's no weapon. I'm gonna take a couple of. Um, Agility axes, maybe. One hand, main hand, I will do those. So I'm going to have some agility stuff. Come on, bro. Force of the Hippogriff. There we go. Okay, but I still have a worn short bow as my weapon. All right. So, in just a few short minutes, what we've done is... Man, Schmitty, this is not tech support time. Uh, in just a few mi short minutes, we have put together our group. We have 
Um, leveled them to 60. Got all our spells. I think all our spells. And we have zero gold. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to a capital city by clicking on this portal. So we're going to tilt the click on the portal because we're fancy. Well, four of them clicked. This one didn't. We're going to single click on him. Here we are in Orgrimmar. Can you tell I'm kind of a whore guy? Oop, one other guy didn't click. I'm going to click him over here. Jump him down. Jump him down. Remember, you just... you you. In 5MinuteMoldyBoxing.com, you control your other characters as simply as moving your mouse to their window. And in fact, remember when I told you you can make any window the boss? I'm going to go over to this window, I Priest. I'm going to hit Alt-4 a few times. Now he's the boss. Everybody's following him. He the boss. He not the boss. This guy's a boss. I Warrior's the boss. Head over here, Alt-4 twice. Everybody's following him. That's how easy it is two five-minute multi-box. All right, so I'm getting a little discouraged here because I know what's coming next. I'm like, okay, I've got five guys, but um, I have no mounts, and I have no dungeon nearby to go to aside from Rage Fire Chasm. I have no money. I have eight copper. Okay, I have some money. I, have eight co I don't know how that guy got 8 copper. Don't exploit my 8 copper, bro. I have 8 copper. Uh, so what I'm going to do, instead of going into an instance, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to uh, STV, and I'm going to show you how we can start um, killing noobs. Healing noobs. Hey, how many people are watching Smitty? Uh, Chaos, the guy who helps me with the server. Um, he's the real brains behind running the server. Uh, he did a 12-hour stream on Twitch yesterday. Like, what? What? 12 hours? Yes, I want to grow my... I want to grow my base. I want to grow my my audience, guys. I ain't gonna do no twelve hour streams. You're you're lucky to get a two hour stream out of me, and this will not be two hours. As soon as I kill a few mobs over here, as soon as I kill a few mobs over here, this stream is ending. Um, okay, we're gonna go over here and wait for the STV. STV, uh. And now, the exciting part. Waiting for the Zeppelin. A toast to 5-Minute Multiboxing and MultiboxWow.com. <sighs> okay, so we'll answer Let's Play Smitty's question. I'm having trouble with my one druid tank wanting to function to um, bear form. He always goes to cat form. That's probably because he's not listed as a tank in your tunelist.txt. If, if a druid is not listed as a tank in tunelist.txt and he is specced feral, guess what's going to happen? He's going to think he's a feral. I don't care what you put besides tank. Well, I mean... I don't care actually what he's listed as. I think um, the spec the spec is favored. I'm not sure. I'm not going to look it up right now. Screw you, man. What do you think? I memorized all my code. Anyways, um, he's going if he's spec kitty if he's spec feral and he's not listed as a tank in fa in your tune list of text, then he's going to try to be a feral and he's going to keep switching to cat. There's no switch to cat in um in uh druid tank in any of the druid tank functions um i don't ever switch to cat in any of those functions the only time you'll ever see a switch to cat is in uh is if he's not listed as a tank in the tank list okay so i'm going to show you guys a new trick in multiboxing in multiboxing the arrow keys move everybody so if i hit 
down arrow, everybody backs up. Notice that? I'm going to hit up arrow here. Everybody runs on to the um, boat. So we're all waiting to go to STV now. Yes, I put him as a tank. I don't believe you. Sorry. Uh, look in smxtend.lua. Look for the tank list in that file. And I think you will find that he is not a tank. So, there you go. I'm calling you wrong. Now, those of you who are new to 5-Minute Multiboxing, it is extremely complicated code. Don't try to read it right away. Um, just go to the 5MinuteMultiboxing.com um, um, page and look at um, look at this right here. Full control list at this link. I'm going to click on this link. So on Reddit, I do have all the key binds for 5-Minute Multiboxing. I'm going to explain some of them to you today. I'm not going to explain all of them. You have to actually sit down and read all of these. And then you'll know what you can do. Now, I try to keep this list up to date. I believe it is out of date in one or two, in one or two lines. All right? So don't really, like, bust my chops, okay? Might be out of date in one or two lines, but uh, um, there you go. Find out everything your stuff doing. I was thinking about subbing if you give subs free portals to get the places easier. Um, I mean, we don't really have subbing. You can you can buy you can buy points on the server in the donate menu, and and um, I don't know. I'll talk about that later. Maybe I'm not even going to talk about that that tonight. But give me money. Um, is that is that good enough? Okay, so we jump. We we use the down arrow to back off of the the zeppelin. Now, notice, notice nobody's following the warrior. So I'm gonna hit Alt four a couple of times. Everybody starts following again. Woo! But they're not just following. All right, guys, they're not just following. I'm gonna hit uh, Nemlock so I auto run. They're not just following. They're focusing his target. Okay, so we're gonna roll over here. And we're going to start killing some noobs. We're not killing noobs, actually. We're killing some lobby mobs. But um, there are actually some, some fairly high mobs. Not this level 36, but there are some fairly high mobs to kill. But I will show you the mechanism. Boy Witch! Why is my DPS mate not showing? My DPS mate isn't showing. That's really weird. DPS mate should be showing, um, but it's not showing. It's not even turned on. So I better I better figure that one out. Okay, one of the one of the keys that you'll see on that page is if you hold um, control with one, uh, the warrior will charge. And now. Um, eh. And get V bars up. Okay, so now the magic key when you're multiboxing is two. Two makes everybody shoot. You can see the mage is shooting frostbolt. The hunter is doing jack shit. Um, he don't have a, a bow. He'll the hunter if he doesn't have a bow and he's in melee range, he'll do you know hunter shit. He'll do uh, he'll do stuff. And let's make sure the rogue's doing stuff. Is the rogue is the rogue swinging? Man, these things die too fast. Let's run down to the gorillas. You guys know where the gorillas are, right? Let's see if the rogue's doing something. The rogue does look like he is swinging. Man, I wish my DPS mate was on. I don't know why DPS mate isn't on. It should be on by default. If if a guy is listed as a tank in your tune list, DPS mate will stay on. I'm going to hit slashing it on this guy. See if it turns DPS mate back on. I do not see DPS mate back on, so I don't know what's going on there. 
I'm actually going to go full screen. There's no need to um, show you all the the other multi boxers. So we are going to head south toward the uh, heftier guys to where you know our raid kind of gets stressed. Oh geez, I had scroll lock off. Shadow Panther, what are you doing, man? What are you doing, man? I left my guys back. I left my guys back somewhere. Oh my gosh, I left my guys back because I had scroll lock off. One of the things that you'll do wrong in multiboxing is um, you'll forget to turn scroll lock back on. Guess what that means? You're not multiboxing anymore. I left somebody across the river. I'm going to go get him. Alt 4, Alt 4, Alt 4. Are we ba all back together? We're all back together. No, we're not quite all back together. Let's kill this thing. I think we're all back together now. Oh, out of range. Bam! Okay, let me just go small. Make sure everybody's with me. Everybody's with me. Okay, let's go kill some gorillas. Maybe they'll drop a shield I can use. Gorilla! Now, uh, because we're running five minute multi boxing, the healers are healing, the casters are casting, the hunters are hunting, and the rogues are roguing. Everybody's doing their jobs. Their jobs. They took their jobs. Everybody's doing their jobs, and we're jobbing it up, man. Woo, some old you too. Now notice everybody continues to face wherever they're following, all right? So you're going to have facing problems until you get savvy. By the way, the, uh, the, the third mouse button, I think mouse four, I think I program as auto run. I forgot about that. I'm hitting control, but I am not getting ready to charge. I guess it's because I'm I'm within charge range. Why isn't control one working all of a sudden? Not charging. Oh, I don't know why control one wasn't working. Uh, wait. I'm getting some Discord chatter. Let me see what's going on in Discord. Uh, it's Dave. Oh man, I just found the perfect job listing. Okay. Dave, Dave talking to me about some other shit. Dave doesn't even realize I'm streaming. Dave, do you know I'm streaming? There we go. Oh, I was too, I was too, I was too close to charge. Look at the hunter, man. The hunter's in melee range, so he dropped, he dropped an explosive trap. I wrote that. I wrote that. That was my code, baby. That actually wasn't my code. Actually, oh my gosh, 420 is gonna. Kill me if I don't give him credit for that. 420 um, gave me the code that. Oh, why are you not charging? God dang it. Control 1 is charged, damn you. My boy is dropping explosive trap a little too far back. Now, you're not going to have fun playing 5-Minute um, Multiboxing if you don't read all the controls and understand that I have basically everything on lockdown. When you get savvy with the controls, you will be able to run 40 tunes into um, Zolgarub and get your Tiger mount and kill bosses. You'll be able to run 40 tunes into Molten Core and kill bosses and get your Thunder Fury. That's right. And you'll win every roll. And you will say, Fury Swipes, you are the bomb. You are the bomb. You are not an old man. You are not washed up. You are not an engineer who's valueless, who's worthless, who's never going to go anywhere in life. You're the bomb. And I'll be like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> you are so right. Now, uh, keep in mind that when rogues do their rogue stuff, they stop following. A lot of uh, a lot of classes stop following when they do their class stuff. So after each fight, after each win, ooh, I should check for a shield. After each win, you have to hit Alt Four again to make everybody follow again. Eh? I think the 
charge for the cooldown for charge is longer than I remember. It goes back to what 420 said on my Discord when I said, "Should I do a uh, should I do a video teaching people how to um, how to play classic?" And 420 says, "Well, don't you need to learn how to play WoW before you can do a video about how to play?" You're banned. You're banned. That guy's banned. 420, you're so banned. Watch my video. Okay, Player Salt says, I'm probably going to find box level in Classic for fun. How hard is doing some of the dungeons as you level for gear? I'm mostly concerned about keeping the tank up. Okay, so let me just break your heart and say none of this shit works on Classic because it, Classic is not vanilla. Classic is some bullshit, kit-bashed version of vanilla and live WoW. And they take away all this beautiful ability to write code and control your tunes from code the way we did in vanilla so screw you blizzard for not making vanilla vanilla it ain't so when you want to five box five box in classic you have to five box like they do in live which is very crude where you're basically microing every single character all right so these are getting a little higher these are level 41 yes i know they're they're kind of too high, but I'm going to hit back. Now I'm going to show you. If you hit the one key, your rogue will come from. Ooh, the mage pulled aggro. What's up, mage? I mage, otherwise known as image, pulled aggro. Damn. I wish I knew how much DPS he was doing. God dang it. I cannot believe... I auto turned off DPS mate. That sucks. Maybe I didn't even put DPS mate in the add-ons package. No, it was there. It was there. No, I saw it when we first logged in. Is there a shield? Woo! Charge is up, baby! No, that's not charge. That's intercept. God dang it. I'm not charging. I'm intercepting. That's what's happening. I'm not charging on control one. I'm intercepting. Um, maybe charge is not control one. Maybe ch charge is alt one. Um, let me try alt one. I think charge might be alt one. It's been a while since I actually multibox, guys. Get off my back! I got obligations, things to do! <laughs> I got the obligations! Uh, I'm gonna try alt one. Alt one. Alt one. Alt one. Alt one. Nope. Alt one doesn't do it. <sighs> I think I've broken charge. God dang it! I hate it when I break stuff. Shield? No shield. By the way, when you log into my server, you do know all flight paths, and if you Pester me on Discord. I will give you a thousand gold at, as a one-time gift. So do log into my server, contact me on the Discord channel, and I'll give you your gold. No shield. All right. Well, look, guys. This is the way it goes. This is how you multibox on WoW. I showed you how to do it from beginning to end. You have no reason not to try it on multiboxwow.com. And now I would like to show you a little bit of, of uh, ways to give me money. Let's go to uh, www.multi... Whoa, turn off, scroll up. Multiboxwow.com. 
Now I want to direct your attention to the donate to the donate screen. If you log into the donate screen, uh, what was my thing? Big don't get one. Ooh. And then you go to the shop, or you go to the, the donate. First, you can donate. That's the important part. Um, you want to donate $10. Um, these are all U.S. dollars. Man, or, did I want U.S. dollars? I didn't want U.S. dollars. I wanted euros. So you can donate. You can really donate any. But one U.S. dollar equals one credit. Um, I, I do want that to be euros, though. I may have to change that. Um, let's go back to the donate menu. Ah, go back. Once you donate, you get credits. And with those credits, you can buy some stuff. All right. And what I want to direct your attention to is not the pets, not the mounts. You can buy the mounts. Can you buy the ZG mount? Mm, doesn't look like you can buy the ZG mount. Good. You shouldn't be able to buy the ZG mount. You can buy some cosmetic stuff. But this is the important part. Two credits gets you 10 flasks, all right? Now, flasks are a little bit different on MoldyBoxWow.com. They, each of those 10 flasks, each of those 10 flasks sells for, I think, three gold, okay? So you can buy those flasks and immediately turn them into money, all right? And you can also trade me those flasks as a GM. You can trade me like 30 of those flasks and I will give you I will give you a profession at 300. All right? So that's how it works. It's something like that. I don't know what the deal is. I I forget I forget what the exact numbers are, but anyway, keep that in mind. Buy flasks and um, fund the server, help fund the server. Um, the server does cost money to run. Uh, it costs about 50 euros a month. 50 euros a month? Is it 50 euros a month? I think it's 50 euros a month to run. So help me out, man. Help me out, sucker. Come play on MoldyBoxWow.com and um, have fun with us. And get on the Discord, ask questions, and uh, have a good time. Later, suckers.